Hello, this is Bloodstorm, and welcome to another Minecraft video inside of my fantastic world. Today, in this video, I am going to be building a brand new shop. But first, before I do anything, as you can see when I'm doing my intro, I've got a new area over here, which I'll show you in just one second. But first, before I do that, I need to go and, uh, and have my breakfast, and... Let's see what I get today. So let's just check. Oh, what's this? Raw mutton. Okay, so today in this episode, I'm going to be building a shop which is related to redstone. Uh, but yeah, before I do, uh, well, start building, uh, let me show you the new area which I have down here. So opposite the little corridor to the club room, down these stairs, there's a nice little window which you can see through my room. But not only that, when you look this way, you can see I've got a nice little living room or a front room. I'm just going to say a living room because it's not out the front or anything. Uh, but yeah, uh, there's going to be all sorts of stuff going on in here. Who knows? Maybe there might be a Christmas tree going like around here. I don't know. I might put a Christmas tree here when it's like Christmas times or something. But yeah, this is my front room. And I've got a nice little chair if you're reading a book, which is from uh, from here. Uh, right, there's also another new area which I need to show you as well. And uh, that's over by the beach. So, I've been a bit busy outside of the episode. I'm not building over there though. I'm building like over in this area. Uh, but first, um, let me just show you this little area which I have over here. So, over here, I had this little wall area which I built quite a while ago. Can't remember when. But I had this little wall area built. Yeah, like that. And uh, I've got like a little dock area. So over here, I've got a nice little canoe, which I have built. I uh, don't know how good it is going to work. Uh, can I even? No, I don't think it's going to work. I think you need two people to sail this canoe. Uh, but yeah, I've got this little dock area here with a nice ladder leading up to and down there. And then over here, I've built a little area up over here with like some more like... Um, what, what do you call this? Decking or... Well, they're basically, this area is going to be turned into a dock. So, at some point, uh, I'm going to build, like, some sort of yacht or something. I might build a yacht at some point or, like, some normal ship. I want to have, like, a fancy yacht. Maybe a normal ship going here. But over here, I have plans on building a massive cargo ship. Which is going to be used for something. Don't know what yet. I haven't designed it yet. I haven't designed any of this yet. Uh, but yeah, I just had some ideas to like build a yacht or like a, a whole dock over here. Uh, but yeah, let's head over to my doggy house and let's see which dog I'm going to be taking with me today. And I thought, I thought I heard a creeper then. No, I didn't. Uh, right, let's head over under here and let's see who should I be joined by. Hmm. Who should I be joined by? Greg, you're over here by yourself. You can stand up and join me. And uh, right, let's head over to where we are building. So... I'm building a shop which is related to redstone, and we're building it right next to my archaeology adventure shop. Uh, as you can see, I'm not being joined by Josh or any helper. Uh, the reason why I'm not being joined by Josh is because I think he deserves a little break after that four episodes. He's been working quite hard, so yeah, I let him have a little break. Uh, but yeah, maybe uh, when I'm building a brand new minigame, which is over there, he could help me build that. Uh, but first, let's get started. So, in each of the corners, there's going to be cobbled deep slate built up four blocks over in this corner here. And it's the same dimensions as well uh, as the archaeology adventure sh um, little shop or build. And uh, I don't think I've shown you it like fully complete yet after after it was blown up by a creeper. Uh, but yeah, let's just uh, place these here. Let me just quickly... Let me just quickly show you what the inside here looks like. So, yeah, this is pretty much what it looks like. Properly complete without any explosions or anything. Um, right, let's head over uh, back here. And, right, let's get started. So, let me get the these images up onto my screen. Uh, where are they? Here they go. So, the, the front of it... Oh, no, that's the wrong image. The front of it is going to be quite different uh, to any other build. So... We have iron bars, and I'll explain that in just a minute, but first, uh, let me place the redstone in each of the corners. So there's going to be there's gonna be one in the corner there, 
and then gap of two, and then one up top here. And it's going to be the same over here. And I need to do one, two, three with redstone going there. And it should line up in the middle. And it's going to go like that along the entire um, front like that. Uh, but yeah, I, the reason why I went with this style is because I had no clue what I wanted to do with this style. Uh, because I just I wanted it to seem like some sort of mechanic -y sort of. Uh, but I couldn't really come up with a good design. So I just went up with some sort of dungeon themed. Uh, but there's going to be all sorts of like redstone stuff. It's going to be like some sort of teaching area where you get taught redstone and like all sorts of, red all sorts of redstone in here. There's not going to be a lot because it's a small build. But, oh, I should have built over here. There could be like loads. But no, I'm happy with this design. Uh, but here, there's going to be an oak door, which I won't do now. I'll do that outside of episode or uh, if I have time. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much the front. Uh, let me just go get some... Uh, cra make a crafting table just like that. There we go. And uh, I need to make. Oh, I don't need that. You know, I might as well just place the door down now. Yeah. Once again, I'm always going with the oak doors. I don't think there's a shop. Oh, I know. I've used that. Um, yeah, my plant paradise shop. Uh, I used a dark oak door instead. Uh, so let's make some deep slate bricks. Uh, let me just make a whole stack of these. I don't think I'll need a lot of normal deep slate bricks. Uh, but yeah, the whole. Actually, no, I'll do the roof. Uh, shortly so this needs to go along like this and it's going to be up the top here and the entire redstone blocks are going to be in the same sort of spots so there's going to be some in the corner and then some in the middle just like this and let's see so this goes along down like this and then I need to get some stone no deep slate bricks and yeah it's also an excuse for me to use the deep slate bricks like I never really used these deep slate bricks. Uh, when was the last time I actually used any deep slate in a, a build? Um, let me just check. Except for that, that over there, that little dock area. I don't think I've used deep slate bricks at all. No, so pretty much this is the first time I'm actually using deep slate bricks. Uh, yeah, at some point, um, I, when the Caves and Cliffs update does somehow, well, does come out. Uh, hang on, what's the side supposed to look like? Uh, yeah, the side is correct, so it goes, yeah, it just goes polished deep, um, deep slate like that, and then it just goes normal deep slate at the top. Uh, if I don't have enough redstone, I've got loads in one of my chests in my storage room. Uh, but I remember in my old fantastic world, I had this really, really old idea to do like some sort of scrap sort of area, like some recycle plant sort of type thing. And I was thinking of calling it Storm Scrap Service, but... That idea, I scrapped that idea. Uh, oh wait, was that supposed to be a pun? Didn't mean for it to be a pun or anything or whatever. Uh, but yeah, I I scrapped that idea I, um, because I just I just can't come up with a good design. But at some point, who knows? I might come up with like another idea to like do the storm scrap service. I don't know the SSS. Uh, but right, uh, that's pretty much the front. And you're right there. Um, what is it, Greg? You got a new pig friend here. Hello, what's your name? Goodbye. Goodbye, pig. Uh, that wasn't a friendly pig. That pig just walked away when I asked it a question. <laughs> um, right, so hopefully I have enough. Actually, no, I do have enough. I think I've got the right amount of blocks I need. So there needs to be three at the bottom. And yes, I have enough. I have the perfect amount of redstone blocks. There we go. So yeah, the whole uh, back part is going to be the same as these walls as well. Uh, it may look um, a bit... Actually, no, it won't look odd from the inside. Uh, I was thinking of doing, like, um, a back entrance here as well. So, there's going to be two entrances. The first entrance is, like, a normal entrance. But then, the back entrance would be, like, some sort of redstone uh, doors. But, no, I just thought, why not do it? Keep it simple for some people. And this part is wrong. The redstone needs to be up one more. Up like this. There we go. And... The redstone inside isn't going to be too complicated. It's going to be like one of the trickiest redstones, uh, which I have, um, which I've done in my fantastic world, in both fantastic worlds. But no, don't worry, it's not that complicated. It's just like a technique I've used. Uh, but yeah, this is basically the entire outside. Uh, like the little walls complete. The floor, I believe, is birch. Yeah, the floor's going to be birch in there. But let me head up to the roof. Uh, let me just do a little staircase. 
going up like that. There we go. Let me make a few uh, polished slabs which will go on each of the corners. And uh, yeah, these will go on top of the deep slate. There's a couple deep slate. And when the 1.19 update comes out, I'm planning on going to find the warden. So there's like all sorts of stuff you can find in the um what is it in the new caves but yeah i want to go find the warden because that is my worst nightmare in minecraft because yeah it's pretty much in the dark and darkness in minecraft is probably my number one enemy except for malice or surge or sidero ignore any of those villains uh but yeah basically uh these walls are going to go up like this and um oh yeah so the chiseled Deep slate. This is going to be like one of the trickiest parts because on the screenshot it blends in really well. So in the middle, it goes along the entire way like this, and then it goes two out on the front. So I need to go over back to the front, and then it needs to go one, two, I believe. Yep, and then it goes deep slate bricks like that, and then we go one, two. And then we go uh, through like this. And there we go. This is quite simple. Didn't seem that simple, but don't worry, it is. Uh, so let me just get some more deep slate bricks. It's going to go just like that. There we go. And then this here is going to be filled in like that. And this is just so when you're on the outside, you sort of get a little view. Uh, for, if you're like up high, let's say the hotel, and you look over here, or the mini games. You can see like a nice little pattern. Sort of blends in though, but it's still a nice pattern. And this needs to go... How far does it go? Three in. There we go. And then this is basically the entire pattern which is going to go on the whole top. So, oh gosh. How do I do this then? So when bricks... Oh, it, it looked easy at first, but no, it's not. Uh, oh, I've just fallen down. We need to go three, I believe. Yep, yeah, and this should line up perfectly and all i've got to do on this part is do the exact opposite so actually no i find it easier doing it from the top for some reason i don't know why it just seems easier and there's no phantoms is there no i've actually been sleeping now instead of like skipping uh my uh bedtime uh so this needs to go like this and then go three and then one in the corner and there we go i'm getting used to this now saying that I've already forgotten how to do it so we need to go once again three and then nope that doesn't go there this needs to go one two three and then how do I do this part so it needs to go two and then one two and then there we go this is the entire roof and probably the entire outside of the build uh 100% complete well except for the little gaps which i haven't even filled in just here but there we go this is pretty much the entire build complete uh so yeah this is going to be the end of the episode uh the name of the shop i haven't got a name so you'll have to wait until the next episode but uh for now thank you all so much for watching and i'll see you all in the next one bye